Elton Williams of the TV show If Loving You Is Wrong on the OWN Network, Oprah's Network, and it's directed by, of course, the great Tyler Perry. The final episode, November the 29th. You guys have got to check it out. There's three more, if I'm correct. There's three more three episodes more. that are before right. the 29th, and, and I DVR it all the time because I'm, you know, I'm always ra I'm rolling them. So my lady's always like, "Turn that off! I want to watch what is that? The uh, Real Housewives?" Uh, something, you know? yeah, yeah, I'm like, "No, no, no, no!" <laughs> so sometimes I have to watch your show in the wee hours and stuff. But what can you tell us about the show that a lot of us, you know, uh, would like to know behind the scenes? I know there's one little secret or something. Yeah, man. You, you know where I'm leaning to is like what's about to happen. Yeah. I know you can't talk too much, <laughs> but I'm trying to sneak it in there. Right, you're trying to sneak it. What can I say? I would tell you that this season, um, I just remember getting the script for these uh, these, these final three episodes, um, season finale in particular, and just being like, what? Like, if you talk to the cast, we all had to put the script down. Like, I can't believe we went there. You know, I can't. I can't this is this is uh, it's not really something I've seen done in many other TV shows, anything, anything that I can come comes to mind. It's just, um, it, it's intense, and it just, uh, it's, it, it, it's not just, you know, light, fun, happy time. It, it, mm -hmm. it gets into some, some places that uh, make you think, make you want to come back for more and just see, wow, wow, what have we, what have we tapped into here? And uh, mm -hmm. it, it's really, <laughs> I, without giving anything away, it, it's, it's intense, and it's, um, it's something that needs to be watched. What's next for you? I mean, I'm going to assume you're going to have another season of this show, but beyond that, where do you see yourself? You know, beyond that, you know, I've, I've started a production company. Um, mm -hmm. um, yeah, and so there's two pilots that we're uh, writing and trying to pitch right now coming up, and, and also features. So um, I really want to get, I've been inspired a lot by, by Tyler and what he does, um, and just kind of writing and producing, you know, carving your own path mm -hmm. in this business, because it, you have to, you know, otherwise you never know what's going on next. You can't let anybody else determine your path, you know. Right. So, um, so that's that's really a lot of my focus, and, and uh, also just, just still auditioning. There's so much great TV and, and film out there going on, so I'm uh, always keeping an eye out for that. But really trying to focus on, on uh, you know, doing my own thing. That's cool, man. Yeah. I'm so glad you stopped through. Yeah, I'm glad you guys had me. I, I, I understand you sing a little bit too. Uh, I used to. <laughs> I so used to. everybody's going to be asking, why didn't you have him sing the wave song? <laughs> I, I guess you need to just throw that in there just real quick, Anthony. Come on, Anthony. I mean, you know, it's one of my favorite songs. You mean a little? You listen to the station, so I know you know the song. Ninety-four seven, the wave. Yeah! <laughs> I can't sing, y'all. I can't sing, y'all. <laughs> oh, let's just say I like your acting. But, uh, <laughs> thanks for coming through, man. All right, man. Thanks for having me. We appreciate you. <laughs>